Unlocking the power of phrasal verbs in everyday conversation. Hello, language learners. Today, we're going to dive into the fascinating world of English phrasal verbs. We'll learn how these unique verb structures work and why they're so important in everyday conversation. Understanding the context of phrasal verbs will not only enhance your comprehension but also improve your English speaking abilities. Phrasal verbs are a combination of a verb and one or two particles. These particles can be prepositions or adverbs. Phrasal verbs often take on entirely different meanings from the original verb, which is why they can sometimes be a challenge to learn. Example, to look is to use one's eyes, but to look up means to search for something, often in a reference book or an online source. Phrasal verbs can have multiple meanings depending on the context they're used in. Therefore, understanding the situation or conversation they're used in is key. Context not only helps us comprehend the meaning of phrasal verbs but also guides us when to use them appropriately. Example, turn on, could mean starting an electronic device, like a TV, or it could mean to cause someone to feel attraction or interest. One of the best ways to understand phrasal verbs is by listening to English conversations. As you identify phrasal verbs in dialogue, make a note of the context and how it impacts the meaning. Over time, you'll start to get a feel for their usage and nuances. Example, give up, in a sentence like, I give up, this puzzle is too hard, means to surrender or stop trying. Finally, the best way to get comfortable with phrasal verbs is to practice them in different contexts. Try to use them in sentences or in conversation. Don't worry if you make mistakes, the important thing is to keep practicing and learning. Example, try to use, run into, meaning to meet someone unexpectedly, in a sentence, like, I ran into an old friend at the supermarket today. And that's it. By understanding the context, identifying them in conversation, and practicing them regularly, you'll become proficient at using phrasal verbs in everyday conversation. Keep at it, and soon, these tricky verb combinations will become second nature. Thanks for tuning in, and remember, learning English is a journey, and every step counts.